from Caulfield today. Yesterday's record breaker, Therese Payne, won the last on a 25 to 1 chance Megan Vale. Michael Clark went one win closer to Roy Higgins's season record and apprentice Michael Carson maintained his 100% record for trainer Lee Friedman. Carson was riding the favourite Brisk in the first leg of the quadrilla. Just moved away about a neck in front of Zephyr Khan with 150 to go. Now he's a length and a half to two lengths in front and then Kerry Maboy and Brisk is sprinting away now for an impressive win. Goes home to win by three lengths to Zephyr Khan. Last Saturday, Michael had his first ride for the Friedman stable and led all the way on Dame Vengeance. Lee Friedman has a high opinion of Brisk but will resist the temptation to take the three-year-old to Adelaide. He's a, he's a promising little horse, but he hasn't had much racing, and I'd like to sort of keep it that way. And I don't think I'd like to push him into Adelaide too quick, so we'd probably either give him one or two more and spell him or take him to Brisbane. Michael Clark took his season's tally to 71, just four behind the all-time record held by Roy Higgins when he booted home the 10 to 1 chance bip. You know, people are always saying to me, you know, you're getting close to it and, and um, those sort of things. And, you know, <clears throat> I'll be excited if I can, can do it. And, um, you know, I'm looking quite forward to it, Bruce. But it wasn't such a good day for bookmaker Arthur White. A mistake with the price call had Steve's return 10 to 1 and not 2 to 1 in race 6 at Gosford. One punter had $600 on the horse to win $6,000 before the error was detected and the gelding started at 7 to 4 and won easily. The quadrilla today on double four five eight six thirty four fifteen daily double four and eight twenty six thirty five. The extra on one and four five twenty five. And in Gosford today, the cup was won by Samara. That race worth seventy five thousand dollars. And the daily double in Gosford, yes, nine and eleven thirty seven dollars and fifteen cents. That's it, David from Sport and Joe. Thank you, Bruce McAvaney, with tonight's sport.